spring is in the air and if you're not inspired to create some delicious and better for you recipes for your next brunch, well, you will be after you hear from our next guest, food and lifestyle expert, Parker Wallace is back and Parker, I, I gotta say, I love having you in studio because a lot of times I feel like we're talking like from far away. So it's great to have you here. Thanks. Talk about a setup. Just wait, folks. We've got a lot of fun stuff to get to, right? I'd like to call it extraordinary. Oh, I I'm not only a culinary goddess, I'm a punster and a wordsmith too. <laughs> I see what you did there. I like it. But I'm a, so, you know, spring <laughs> is in the air, as you said, and it always inspires me, Natalie, to host parties. And I love brunch because then you can, you know, have a little champagne. You can have some specialty dishes. I like to mix it up with breakfast and a little bit of lunch. I like and this. everyone has a great time. And then the afternoon is just gorgeous. I like so, this. Have you heard of Happy Egg? I have not. Okay. Next time you're in Publix, I want you to look for Happy the green egg. label. This is the organic. Okay. And this has been a game changer in our house. Yeah. Because not only do they taste amazing, do they look amazing with this luscious golden yolk, but the way they farm is amazing because there's a reason they say it's the freest of the free range. Happy Egg is a pioneer in free range egg farming. And so what that means is that they actually give happy hens eight acres to roam in pasture, and that's actually 10 times the amount in standard free range farming. Oh, wow. So it's really amazing. And happy hens lay happy eggs. Okay. Which, by the way, I got to say, right. you do notice the bright colors. Okay, with that. these are like farmer market style quality eggs. So check out some of the things that I've done here. This is an avocado toast. I swear to God, people are like, is that real? Is that an actual? I mean, it like, does. It's perfection. Gorgeous, golden, and then you can add it and make egg the star of a roasted skillet. I've got the potatoes, the lovely purple potatoes, and you get all those spring colors in, and then pop them into a little pastry cup. Oh, so you look have at those. it's like an omelet in a pastry. That's a great idea. Right? And then so I'm gonna have you help me build. This is a little egg stack. And I'm a big fan of deviled eggs, so you can actually pop a, a deviled egg on top too. Oh, that's cute. But just start with one of these in-season tomatoes, and then you can layer it with a little bit of Canadian bacon. I like to put a little lettuce on. You've got zucchini. And then, of course, that gorgeous egg on top. You can drizzle a little pesto on or just have it as a low-carb sandwich, which I like, too. That's a great so idea. So check them out at Publix. That's awesome. Okay. Happy eggs. I'm yes. liking it. And something, too, that always makes people happy when we talk sweets, but I think you're doing it in a healthy way, right? Oh, yes. And speaking of, like, you know, when I do a brunch, I love to do a signature cocktail. Oh, that's and a good idea. And Palm Wonderful's 100% pomegranate juice is a staple for me because not only can I make delicious drinks like this, and this is just a little bit of seltzer, a little bit of fresh-squeezed mandarin, and of course, the 100% pomegranate juice, just in this little bottle, four pomegranates, which is Close amazing. An antioxidant superpower, four times the antioxidant superpower element of green tea, okay? So I just boil down four cups of the pomegranate juice, okay. a little bit of sugar, squeeze of lemon, and then look at this consistency, Natalie. This is stunning pomegranate syrup. Okay. Yeah, I saw the pancakes. What? I'm like, when are we going to get to the so, pancakes yeah, let's here? just drizzle a little bit of that onto our stunning protein pancakes. I made these with a little bit of cottage cheese in the blender and some oats. Oh, yes. Drizzle wow. that on. Wow, that looks good. I, I see forks here. I know we've got to go ahead and yes. get, to, uh, get to our Wonderful next, halos. but I might be going back there as well. But so, Yes, halos. This is the biggest supply of halos ever, and they will be gone in like three minutes Which, with this group here because they're so say, delicious. This kind of looks like my uh, kitchen island right now. They're in season through May, which Love is amazing. It. My favorite season is halo season. They're loaded with vitamin C, only 50 calories, sweet, seedless, obviously easy to peel. I keep them in my purse when I'm traveling because mm -hmm. it's so easy mm -hmm. to just want to feel that sweet treat. And then you can incorporate them. This is sort of a duo of parfaits. This is whipped ricotta with a little bit of honey and lemon zest with some pistachios on top. Oh, wow. And then you can layer it. How fun does this look, by the way? Right? What kid's not going to like to dive into that? You could do that for dessert. Oh, yeah. Because it's so sweet. Just try a little bit of that of that honey whipped ricotta with oh, the mandarin juice in it. Don't have to twist my arm Just on this try one. It. And then I've taken some chia, mm. which plumps up in yogurt. And again, a little drizzle of honey and then the pop fresh of that gorgeous halo on top. This so. is so fun. These are such good ideas. They look fabulous. Now, in closing, though. Yes. 
My mistake, I always chew. Where can people go to stay up to date on everything that you do have to offer? Because you always Thank have you. such great ideas. Yeah, you can find me on Instagram at Parker's Plate and then head to my site, parkersplate.com, for lots of recipes, tips, tricks, and all of the culinary fabulous. Good stuff. And this, again, is fabulous. Thank you, oh, Parker. Thank you. I'm going to dive into you right there with your girl.